hey what's happening everybody welcome back to the channel for those of you that have been watching definitely appreciate it for those of you that this is your first time the channel's name is saltwater buffalo i go by the name buffalo and today we're back out here at oak island pretty much as always um i am in the same exact spot as i was in my last video where i lost that really big fish so if you've not seen that video yet, I'll put a link in the description down below. You guys go back and watch that. Let me know your thoughts on what you think that was. We'll see today if I can find that guy. I don't know what it was. It was huge, whatever it was. So I'm kind of hoping today for a little bit of redemption with that. Uh, but I got some mud minnows I'm gonna throw around. Got a bunch of soft plastics and everything. So we're gonna give this thing a whirl and see what we can put on the boat. All right, so first thing we're gonna do, throwing around, is this little voodoo shrimp. I've hit it up with some Procure inshore salt water. Um, I've never thrown a voodoo shrimp around before. So I have no clue how good or how bad these things are. Everybody swears by them, so I figured I'd try them whenever I was at the store this morning, picking up some bait. So we'll see. Um, We'll see if it's any good or not. Mr. King Croker right here. Yeah, buddy. As always, nothing much, but it's another fish. So I just need to find their cousin, the big old redfish. Come on, baby, be on there, be on there. Come on, yeah, there we go, all right. Good fish, good fish, good fish, finally. Finally got us a good one here. Let's get this floor out of the way. Oh yeah, come on. Hopefully I don't lose this guy this time like I did the other day feels pretty decent just hope it's not a stingray and I hope I can keep it pinned let's see here I'm not going to screw this one up we're going to slow play it I don't know what the heck this is it's got to be a stingray I don't think that's a redfish Where are you at? Come on. What do we got? There's my weight. What do we got? I still ain't seen it yet. Dang, what the heck is that? Holy sh shoot. Oh my god. This is the biggest trout I think I might have ever seen. Holy smokes. Oh, what a freaking dinosaur. Oh, my Lord. Oh. oh, come on. Come on, don't. Don't screw this up. Don't screw this up, Billy. Oh, no, no, no. Come on. Come here. 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 Oh, 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 my God. Oh, 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 holy crap, oh my god, oh, this can't be a real trout, there's no way, oh my lord, this thing is an absolute unit, 
<laughs> oh, look at this thing. Look at this thing. Oh, oh my god. This thing is freaking massive. Oh, I got this guy on a mud minnow. Oh, and he choked it too. Oh, he choked it. I don't know. Oh. Oh, crap. Oh, come on, buddy. Give it up. Give it up here. There we go. All right. I've got to get a measure on this. I always keep trout, but I'm not going to lie. This one here, anything, they say anything over 20 inches is your really big breeder fish. They lay over a million eggs a year. So as much as I would love to take this guy home, I'm not going to do it. What do we got here? That is my new PB. He is sitting right at 24 inches. Let's freaking go, man. 24 inch trout on a mud minnow. Oh my lord. That thing is a freaking dinosaur. I'm gonna get some pictures of it and let's go. All right, one last look at this puppy right here. Let's get a nice good release on it. I it out of the water for a little bit trying to get some pictures and stuff like I said these big fish like this we're going to take care of them man I mean these are the ones that keep producing for us she's about ready yeah it's um especially these trout they're trying to limit our trout regulations here in North Carolina quite a bit there she goes. Hell yes. Oh man. It has been slow. I've been out here for probably two and a half hours. Really haven't caught anything yet. And man, does that help bring this day up right there. So I am super pumped. New PB for the day. Well, not even for the day. New PB of my life. 24 inch redfish. My last one was 23. And both my big trouts like that, I have caught on mud meadows on a Carolina rig, so which is very surprising. But apparently they like them, so I'm gonna keep throwing them at it, but see if we can't find something else. trout this time all right I like it I like it a lot so it's amazing how much smaller this dude is compared to that other one. Oh my oh never came out the lord all right buddy come here I can't keep you in anyway oh it's croaking it's a male so there you go there's a little one he's probably 10 12 inches something like that you know like a quarter of the size of what that last one was but y'all know how i fish man i ain't ever mad about putting anything on a hook i don't care what it is so trout number two
Talk about the tiniest trout ever. Sheesh, that's a big one. Man, look at this monster. <laughs> wow. Oh, give it here, buddy. You wanna talk about a little trout? Look at that guy right there. Man. I don't think they get a whole heck of a lot smaller than that, but trout number three. We got one. Come on, baby. Feels like a decent one. It's not fighting real hard though. That's what's weird. All right, now we got that line cleared. What do we got? Come on, be something decent. It's staying down. That's not a real good sign. Oh no, not in the motor, not in the motor. Of course. A freaking stingray. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Oh, I hate these things. trying to sting me. I ain't messing with that dude. Mm -mm. And he swallowed it. Yep. Get the hell out of here, buddy. Alright, well, that's a bummer. Fish on! What the heck is that? What do we got? Oh, a little flounder. Just a little guy. But they all count whether they're big or small regardless. Especially with these guys because you can't keep them. I know I keep reiterating that you can't keep them, but it's um, most places you can. North Carolina, you can't. I don't know where all I get subscribers from, so when you see me throw these guys back, that's why. Because uh, North Carolina, not allowed to keep them. Just a little one, maybe 10 or 12 inches, something like that. But it's um, it's a flounder nonetheless. Another fish on the boat. All right, y'all. Well, that's gonna wrap it up for the day. Can't say it was a bad day because I did catch that PB trout at 24 inches, so I was pretty pumped about that. Other than that, it was fairly slow. You seen a couple other little trout, got that little flounder, a dang nasty stingray, and some other ones in there. So. Hopefully everybody likes what they've seen so far. If you do, I would appreciate anybody to give me a um, subscribe to the channel. As you see, I'm trying to put out as many videos as I possibly can. But it is what it is. You kind of get what you get also. So um, if you like this, please give me a thumbs up. If you don't, as always, give me two thumbs down. That way I know you really did not like it. And always remember, it's nice to be important, but it's more important to be nice.